Understanding Neutral Internet, a guide for English language learners. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore the phrase neutral internet. This is a term that you might come across in news articles, technology discussions, or debates about internet regulation. Our goal is to help you understand what it means and how it's used in context. So, let's dive in. The phrase, neutral internet, refers to the principle of net neutrality. Net neutrality is the idea that all internet traffic should be treated equally. This means that internet service providers, ISPs, should not discriminate or charge differently based on the user, content, website, platform, or application. In simple terms, it's like saying all vehicles on a highway should have the same speed limit, regardless of what they are carrying. Why is net neutrality important? It's crucial because it ensures a level playing field on the internet. Without net neutrality, ISPs could prioritize certain websites or services over others. For example, a streaming service could be made faster than its competitors if it pays the ISP more. This would be unfair to smaller companies and could limit the choices available to consumers. There are different views on net neutrality. Supporters argue that it preserves the Internet's role as a free and open platform where innovation can thrive. They believe it protects free speech and prevents large companies from having too much control. On the other hand, opponents argue that removing net neutrality could lead to more investment in network infrastructure and better services for consumers. They claim that ISPs should be able to charge for higher quality services. The approach to net neutrality varies around the world. In some countries, like the United States, net neutrality has been a hotly debated topic with changing policies. In contrast, the European Union has strong laws in place to protect net neutrality. Understanding these differences is important for recognizing how the concept of a neutral internet is applied globally. That's all for our discussion on neutral internet. We hope this video has been informative and helped clarify this complex but crucial topic. Remember, understanding terms like these can greatly enhance your comprehension of technology and current affairs in English. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in our next video.